Welcome everyone to the Thursday product training. My name is Mike File. I'm with FFL Allegiance. This week we're going to talk about Aetna. Every Thursday we do this and uh, we usually take about five or ten minutes and just go through one carrier and go through one product and uh, kind of try to break things down for you and make it a little bit easier for you to understand. I just recently found this out so I definitely want to uh, let everyone know this. When quoting Aetna there's actually an app for it that right there, I just found out like a, a week or two ago, I was sitting down with someone, and they pulled it up on their phone. So I know where it is on an iPhone. If you go to your uh, Apple store and go to quotes on the go, again, it's quotes on the go, and then you can actually download the app so you can quote it right on your phone. Before I was uh, always had to pull up my, uh, I was pulling out my iPad to be able to run a quote for Aetna, but now you don't need to do that, so uh, I found that out. Maybe everyone knows it, and I was the last one to figure that out. But quotes on the go, and then you can download and uh, be able to quote Aetna right off, off your cell phone. So Aetna is a company, and the product that we use for that is the Ascendo product, and this is just for final expense. Um, they are the only final expense carrier that goes all the way past 85. You can actually go to 89 years old. The majority, or actually all of our other final expense carriers stop at age 85. So remember this, Aetna, you can go from 40 all the way until age 89. And then the total amount of insurance you can get is actually based off your age. So from like 40 to 50, you can get $50,000 of whole life insurance and then from 50 to 60, it drops down. I think it's 40,000. And then above 60, all the way up until 89, it's $30,000 of, of life insurance that you can get. So remember that when you're using Aetna. Now, the big thing that we go to Aetna for is for our clients with uh, COPD. We only have one other carrier that can take COPD, but we love, uh, we love Aetna. It's a very easy e-app. And then if you're trying to do uh, telesales, they have a very, very simple e-sign process with their e-apps. So remember that too for Aetna. So let's break down some of the things that Aetna will accept. Now, last time when we talked about using Eagle, you know, we talked about being able to do someone who had a heart attack or a stroke like just over 12 months ago. Aetna, you can actually do the same thing. So here, here's how it breaks down with them. If you had a stroke or a heart attack and it was greater than 12 months, but less than two years, you can get immediate coverage with Aetna with a standard rating. If there was a stroke or a heart attack that was greater than 24 months, you can actually get a preferred rating. And then when we talked about Eagle last week, we talked about them and cancer had to be two years. Now with Aetna, if you had cancer and it was more than 24 months ago that the diagnosis, treatment, everything else took place, you can get a preferred rating with Aetna. And again, that's immediate coverage. And if you had, uh, again, the heart attack or stroke greater than two years, you can get preferred coverage with Aetna. Now with Aetna as well, if you have ox, if you're taking oxygen, but it's only for sleep apnea, you can get a preferred rating as well with them. And then Parkinson's and then multiple sclerosis. Those, those two ailments are also a, a standard rating with them. And then again, COPD. What I always like to do and what I tell everyone to do is when we first got Aetna, the first thing that I did was I printed out the paper application and I just started reading through the questions. I really think it's the easiest way to understand what a carrier will accept. I just break it down and understand exactly uh, what the questions are asking. And again, if you're meeting with a client and they give you a particular med medication. Let's say they give you a medicine that is, you, you pull it up in Google and it's used for cancer. Well, then you know that that client had cancer. I immediately turn around and say, okay, when was the cancer diagnosed? And uh, so I, I break it down that way. I, I know there's a lot of people out there that use that, that new application where you plug everything in and it wants to give you all the quotes and tell you what carrier to go to. I let everyone know that, hey, we're a professional, be a professional just read through the applications and understand exactly what that carrier accepts. And I think that the more that you do that, the more comfortable you get. And so when you're meeting with a client, immediately you start to start to understand where exactly that client can be placed. So I hope everyone understands that Aetna is a, is a great carrier. Um, they, they take some things that some of the other carriers won't. They also pay us very, very high compensation on their products. 
So when you're out there, make sure that you're using Aetna. They're definitely the second in line when I get a turn down on Americo. So again, read through the application, understand exactly what Aetna will accept. They have a very, very simple e-application process. And for me, again, maybe I'm the last to find out that you can't quote it on your phone, but download the quotes to go application. It makes things a lot easier when you're meeting with the client. All you have to do is pull out your cell phone and start quoting the price. So until next week, everyone make it a great day. Mm -hmm.